What's up, peeps? Nick Battle, a.k.a. Nino's Corner, man. First off, if you like this content that's coming to you on this YouTube channel, go hit that subscribe button right now. Go like and comment on all the videos. But if you're listening to this on the podcast, man, go to any podcast platform. Go give me a comment, a five-star review, a like, something that means a lot. Helps me get everything up for this, this podcast and more content coming to you. But today, we're going to talk about the transfer portal and how great that has been to the University of Texas, especially today. Uh, Texas is, you know, actually landed Keelan Robinson, uh, four-star running back, transfer from Alabama. Um, and this is big, guys, because this guy has a straight speed. He is, hey, guys, I always tell you guys about Steve Sarkeesian. Speed, speed, speed. That is what Steve Sarkeesian wants. That is what Sark wants in his team. And you see it with his recruiting at the wide receiver position. You see at his, you know, just all-around offensive uh, skill play recruiting. He loves a lot of speed. And you can see how he utilized that speed at Alabama last year. So, what does he bring? Keelan Robinson, like I said, is somebody who's very fast. Uh, he's he's a quick twitch guy that, that can make you miss. Um, he brings in uh, uh, somebody who Nick Saban has quoted saying that he has the juice. And when you talk about the juice, you're talking about somebody who can take it um, a three-yard run, can extend that three-yard run to 20 to 30 yards, can take a 20-yard run to the house. That's the kind of speed that you're getting here with Keelan Robinson, man. I cannot wait to see this guy here in the 40. And talking about the 40, guys, we're going to talk about this, this running back room and how stock this running back room is now. You got B. John Robinson, who many believe and who I honestly believe is a top three running back in the country. Uh, quite possibly the best running back in the country this year for 2021. You have another running back in Roshan Johnson, who Rojo just keeps proving people wrong. He is the guy who came in really, really good last year. If you look at my NCN metrics, Roshan, I think he clocked in a 62-point NCN score, which is great. Guys, the average is 45 points for an offensive skill position player. Bijan Robinson actually uh, had an 82 or 83-point NCN, which is outstanding. I got to do my metrics on Keelan Robinson, man. So Keelan Robinson, I got to get that in. I'm going to have it. He had limited snaps last year, but he, I think he had eight carries, 92 yards against Western Kentucky, if I'm not mistaken. Um, but he is, he is somebody who, once he gets his hands on the ball, guys, he has gone to the house. He's a guy that you can bring down from the running back position, put him in the slot, um, let him do damage, let him do some work. Uh, he can do a lot of things. He'd be a very versatile player here for the Texas offense, especially in Steve Sarkeesian's offense. So brings another pass catcher out the backfield, bring somebody with a bunch of speed out the backfield, a great compliment back to Bijan and Roshan Johnson. So you got a guy who can come in here and do some great things. That running back room, like I said, guys, is going to be stacked. Bijan. Roshan, uh, Keelan Robinson, Jonathan Brooks, Watson. You got some guys here who can do some great things. I am excited to see what this Texas offense can do next year, especially with the addition of transfer Porter guy, Keelan Robinson from the University of Alabama. You guys know that my wife is from Alabama. I have two nieces that graduated from University of Alabama. I have two sister-in-laws that graduated from University of Alabama. Uh, so they're hating life right now, and I'm loving it right now that – we just took one of their guys. We took their offensive coordinator and their future head coach, and now we're just taking a bunch of their coaches with uh, Flood and and Banks, and and now we're taking some of their players off their team. Um, so my nieces probably hate me right now, but it is what it is. Uh, my wife, uh, you know, pretty much just told me stop stealing all of you know everybody from Alabama. Uh, I said, hey, it is what it is. We got Sark, and now we got Keelan Robinson. So on that note, man. Drop me a line. Let me guys, hey guys, let me know what you think about this pickup. Do you think this is going to be a really good pickup for Texas? Do you see Keelan Robinson actually being utilized here at Texas? Um, uh, I say yes. I say this is awesome because we are one running back hit away from not having Bijan and not having a guy like Bijan on your team uh, can really just take over your season. It can make your season go from a ten to a five real quick. Um, and let's be honest, if Tom Herman would have probably played Bijan a lot last year, he's probably still the coach here at Texas. So we're one hit away from not having Bijan, which means that we need as much running back depth as we can get here in this running back room. Like I said, Roshan Johnson is a guy that we know can step in and start if need be. Now you got a guy like Keelan Robinson who can definitely step in and be that change of pace back, a third down back, or potentially take on the carries. He doesn't really have the frame for that yet. I think he's 5'10", 190 pounds, but he's a guy that can come in and do some great things here, whether it's on third down, whatever, but he can go in the slot. You can even run out 
uh, personnel that has two running backs in the backfield, have him kind of run from the backfield into the slide, or do some things with Bijan, who is a great pass catcher and route runner himself. This is this is very good. This is very interesting here for Texas. Um, I love what this brings here to the team. Um, and then you got Gabe Watson who is just one of those guys that showed out in the spring game. I was very, very, very surprised at what he did. And then we got Jonathan Brooks, who was Mr. Texas football this past year, um, true freshman coming in this year. So we got a bunch of talent here, man. I am loving it. Uh, kudos to Coach Sark for going out and getting the best talent, whether it is recruiting, whether it's transfer portal. Um, so we are lining up to get some great skill positions. Um, I would like to see him kind of shake the uh, shake the leaves on the tree and shake the branches of the tree as some offensive linemen in the transfer portal, possibly. But them not going out and getting offensive linemen here in the transfer portal lets you know that they're very comfortable with what they have here on campus. And maybe Cal Flood can get the best out of the, the best ability out of these guys here on campus. But let's keep it to Keelan Robinson here. Uh, kudos to get him on the team. Can't wait to see what he does here on the 40 acres. And on that note, guys, man. Nino's Corner, man. I'm out, man. Do you. Don't be afraid to fail. I grow your environment. Understand your brilliance. Love you guys, man. Salute to you guys. I'm out. Backward salute. Love you guys. Out.